Send out Damar a prayer. Hamlin, uh, 24 year old uh, Bills safety, gave the world a scare after collapsing on the field during Monday night game against the Bengals. Ham- Hamlin had to receive. Boy. <laughs> I fucked up again. Yeah. Have to receive. <laughs> uh, resuscitation uh, on the field. And he was in stable condition. He got sent to the hospital and was in stable condition. Uh, Skip Bayless. Oh, yeah. Damn. Yeah. Well, before you get in, yeah. Skip Yes, Yeah, I would like to go as well. Uh, I actually watched this live. Like, I, I didn't see him fall off. But, you know, when they showed the replay, man, it was just so, like, mind-blowing and gave me goosebumps to, to know that can happen. Like, man, I still haven't man. seen it. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah, it's it's crazy, bro. Like, you, that kind of fucked me up. But I saw it live, bro, and seeing how, like, the faces and the expressions on the coaches, players, fans, bro, it was, like, kind of, like, surreal. Mm. Like, you never really seen that in sports, bro. Like, somebody was, on, like, he was almost, like, he almost died out there, bro. Mm, yeah. And just, just to see the, the, uh, the, the sadness in the air, bro. Was, was actually pretty crazy, bro. I was watching, like, I was actually putting my clothes up, bro, and I just stopped. Like, I, I, just, I was like, the all I think I was like, bro. We haven't you seen like, nothing like that now, but it has happened. Has, yeah, was, I, it I pretty, was it a pretty hard hit? No, it no, was like it was, a regular hit. Actually, kind defense. of a regular tackle, bro. Yeah, yeah. He, yeah. Defense. he just, he it was just, a, just when, the way he put his shoulder in the chest, you know how they be trying to fight. And they kind of hit heads, too. Yeah. Like, through his, he kind of threw his shoulder, yeah. but he tapped him like this. Mm. Which yeah. is really and he got up fast. The wrong way to tackle. Mm. Yeah, he got up so, fast. And so what? His head hit his chest. No, no, no. He hit so his shoulder. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Imagine, shoulder yeah. Hit the his helmet. Of his chest. The helmet and hit he, the the the, uh, right uh, like the helmet hit the 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 shoulder pads where his heart was. So the impact of the helmet kind of like. The video? No, I don't. I don't want to show. No, the video. we do that. Uh, impact of the helmet kind of like probably kind of like shocked his heart to where like when he got up, all that getting up and. It kind of just probably and just... And they came... Basically, you get yeah. that kind of knocked out of you, you're not supposed to stand up immediately. That fast yeah, like that. Yeah, but yeah, it was more than just the wind. Like, so that, that, that like, heart, like, his heart was... All that but he didn't... Just, I mean, with his adrenaline going, he probably didn't want to thinking like... Yeah, he, yeah, like, I just got... You know what I'm saying? He didn't realize it. Like, like, he literally got up, he stopped, did two steps back, and fell. Because it's like his body we didn't even know. Like, his brain... Like, his brain was telling his body... He was catching up. He was really catching up. A lot of people was criticizing T. Higgins. A lot of people didn't... Like, you don't see it a lot, but there's, there's some criticism out there towards him. But you can't fault him for being the. I did see like that. The, yeah. the type of like receiver, like he was, like trying to fight for extra yards. That's just football. No, like, no, no. I mean, that's, he had nothing to do with that. He wasn't blaming him. Game. No, they wouldn't blaming him. They was trying to say like it was because of what he did. Any player would do the same thing. People exactly. just people. So that's why I did. people want to have. Uh, have yeah, have, have yeah. Have people want a villain. I don't know if uh, the audience can hear you, but Cecil was uh, bringing up the fact that yeah, I knew it. So Cecil was bringing up the fact that uh, people were criticizing T. Higgins for uh, I guess the way he to 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 running into him, but. No, any player in this I mean, that could have, you know what I'm saying? That's football, and people just want a villain anytime something like this happens. Like, you know, it's a tragic thing. Nobody expected it. There's hard hits every single game, like multiple times it a game. It was hard hits before that play. Before that play. You so, know what I'm saying? So, right. like. You got you to gotta realize, like, first of all, Jamar, Jamar's dad said, y'all got to, like, people have to stop sending criticism and, and those type of tweets to T. Higgins, because you got to realize that's for terrible. him to be a part of that and so close to it, it, it hurts. That should hurt him just as much as it hurt everybody else. Mm-hmm. Just, yeah, because he really feels like it's his fault. Fair. If he, you know, T's probably like, damn, like you know, what I'm saying, I feel like this is my fault, Which but it's not, not your but, fault. Yeah. It's just it's a freak accident, bro. Like I didn't, like I didn't when Cecil first told me to go look at it, like. I didn't expect to see what I saw, and as I watched it, more stuff was developing. Like they were like, you know, they got to revive him. I was like, oh, they got to revive him, you know. So I'm like, oh no, like, yeah, but he was out, bro. Like, he was like, they yeah. caved this chest, like uh, his chest plate was, was slightly caved in, and Shoot, they was going bro. so hard trying to get him to stay alive because he was, I ain't gonna say dead, but he was, he was at death's door. Yeah, basically. but in that moment, you got all that stuff on. They they can't. It have been. Yeah, it have took them longer to, to try yeah, to get like that stuff through, off. Yeah. yeah, so they had to like. Yeah, that's yeah. press. Press hard as hell. I get it. But now, bro, it, it, shout it, us, shout us to them though. That for uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. for I mean, being they there. They got out there quick, but they was. Yeah. They was not. They was. It take you know, hour, you know. But they would move people out there. Like no move. Like everybody. Like they was not bullshit. No, yeah. it took about ten minutes when they get. They no, get no, bullshit. No, no. But they on, which that's a long time. They on site. Yeah. No, which that's a no ten minutes to get him 
breathing again is a long time. I really no, bro. If no, that's a long minutes to get them breathing again. Yeah, yeah, that's a long time. To make it to the like no, 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 no. ten minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah it, it took breathing, a minute for them. No, they say he wasn't breathing on his arm, but he had a pulse. So he was no, I'm saying like he was technically like he was at like they say it was very faint, bro. They said like it took about at least ten minutes to get like get a steady. They said he had a pulse. He just wasn't breathing on his own, so it's kind of like yeah. I was, it was unconscious type. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's kinda like he alive, but they gotta get him back conscious. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, so it's, it's kinda it's kinda different. Like and they get the heart back pumping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah. they probably had to take different procedures. Like it's different. Or, if he bro, wasn't if he didn't bro, have a pulse and he wasn't chill, breathing, bro. I'm pretty sure it'd be a lot different. Glad my son played oh, video games. Yeah, bro. I'm I'm just I'm glad that he he didn't die on the field. Like I'm just so happy that didn't happen on TV, bro. Like especially with kids watching and shit. Like I'm just so glad like, that, that that didn't I, happen. Bro. I know about to get on skip, but like, but when I saw that, I said I don't give a fuck about this game no more. I said yeah. I don't worry about this making making it out. I said this game could be put out. I, I, I did not care about watching the rest of that game. I said I hope they don't play. I kept saying I hope like, in my head, I was like I hope they don't play the rest of the game. Cause who? Right. First of all, ain't nobody gonna really want to play. They see their brother, friend go down. Yeah, like you ain't gonna want to tackle I, nobody I don't else. Just go sit me out. I'm, if y- y- y'all wanna play y'all game, I'm gonna sit in the back. I'm not playing, bro. Everybody was crying. Ain't nobody gonna be, be able to really play for real. Yeah. Like, they ain't gonna be trying to. I think you gonna be thinking about audibles and, and play calling when I'm up. No, that be in my mind the whole game. Oh, yeah. I'm, What's the Bengals head coach? Bengals head coach. Uh, Shout out to him, though, for real, because he didn't have to do name. what he did yeah, the yeah, following yeah. morning. He didn't have to go up there to the to the uh, 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 to the hospital and check on Demar and everything like that. Yeah. I get, like hospitality or whatever, but you know, what I'm saying that's not his player. He no, that was been, a player. He could have kept his players intact. He could have been in the locker room keeping keeping his players intact and everything. But what he did, that was. That was, yeah, that was, that was I see his wrong. face. I don't know his name, but shot. Yeah, he, he is a good dude. I be watching his little mic'd up every week. Um, yeah, much love, man. Very not right. his, but the NFL's mic. Yeah, talk about Skip. Ass. That well, Skip. Send out a tweet during uh, all of this. You have a tweet. Yeah, I put the tweet in chat. Also, put the clip too, so we can get to that. When he doubled down on it, uh, uh, oh, yeah, yeah, he sent out the tweet. That uh, shit did. Oh, dude, I am heated. And I and I really used to like Skip, bro, but that kind of I lost a lot of respect for him on that, bro. Uh, he had okay. Here's some of the tweets. He said, uh, "Not exactly." First, first tweet is he's saying, "Not exactly sure what happened to Demar Hamlin." Players on both teams are shaking. Ambulance out there on the field. CPR administrate. Uh, can't remember pl- uh, play being stopped for this. And at the time, just said a pl- prayer for him and his family. Second tweet. I've seen so many horrific injuries suffered on the football field, yet never have I seen a reaction like this. In every other situation I witnessed or covered, the game always went on fairly quickly. The attitude was, hey, that's football. For for these players, this was different. The last tweet, which caught um, <clears throat> a little flack from uh, the sports world, he said, no doubt the NFL is considering postponing the rest of the game. But how? This late in the season, a game of this magnitude is crucial to the regular season outcome, which has suddenly seemed so irrelevant. And he, had a, he apologized after that. Yeah. He had an apology tweet saying that uh, uh, he doubled down on it. Uh, t- was it today's show or was it, no, it was, it was uh, yesterday. Wednesday, yeah. uh, Tuesday show? And uh, he doubled down. I on, actually on put. I just put that in the chat too. If we can pull that up, Linda, I don't know if that's possible. What the video? Yeah. Like, dude, that that pissed me off. We're gonna dude. play the clip. The way he uh, like he was sentimental. He was like, I, and I don't, I don't shout like the one I said. That shit ain't be up. Like, keep that shit to yourself, dude. Some shit you keep to your damn self. First up, uh, uh, DeMar. Here's the clip, guys. Watching that game on Monday night, uh, what happened to DeMar Hamlin struck me a little different. Um, as a brotherhood in the NFL, when injuries happen, when we know injuries are a part of the game, I've seen guys suffer ACLs and Achilles tear. 
but I've never seen anybody have to be revived and fight for their life on the field. Skip tweeted something, and although I disagree with the tweet, uh, and, and uh, hopefully uh, Skip would take it down. I didn't want it. Well, yep. time out, time out. I'm not going to take it down because okay. I stand by okay. what I tweeted. I, mean, I cannot even get through a monologue without you interrupting okay. me. Well, you could have came back, Skip. Well, I thought, Skip, just let me. I, I didn't I, know I, you I were going to bring no, up. No, I was just going to say, Skip, I didn't talking. want to yesterday to get into a situation where DeMar Hamlin was the issue. We should have been talking about him and not get into okay. your not get into your uh, uh, your tweet. That's what I was going to do. But you can't even let me finish my opening monologue without you interrupting. Okay. Yeah. Um. Uh, um. So. Shit. Uh, this is not the first time uh Skip and Shannon has got into it. Uh, uh Skip actually uh went at him about his, his his pro football Hall of Fame career as well. Uh. It's a lot of it's a lot of stuff to break down here. You, you know, we we'll want to go first. I'm gonna get mine out the way. Well, but you know, he get grumpy. He get he starts to show his age, I'm trying to show his, his sensitive side, and it's getting a little weird. Like the skip, I've always stood behind Skip. Uh, you know, I've always liked, it. and I still like him in a sense. But lately, he has lost a lot of respect for me. I don't know if they telling him, "Hey, Skip, you need to be a villain for a couple episodes or, so you get his ratings up." That could be happening. Who knows? But I don't like the Skip. He need to skip this bullshit out of, out of his life. And mm -hmm. go back to the old Skip beat, you know what I'm saying? When he was SB. I don't know who this nigga is. That's, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Um, very insensitive. I'm still sorry. I just don't want to knock that over. Um, Skip, I still love you, you know, but I feel like this is a teachable moment. This is a dangerous thing about social media. Like, it's so easy to just get on your phone and react to something or say something. And, like, you can never get that back. Mm -hmm. In that moment, I'm not going to lie, like, what he said wasn't wrong, but it was insensitive because, like Joe said, what was most important was his well-being. It does not matter about the game no more. And, honestly, if, if he would have really died on that field – how can you finish the NFL season? Like, how can you expect these guys to go out there and really compete at a high level knowing someone just died from doing this? And that's – and he has so many friends and, you know, brothers and teammates and, you know, stuff in the same game. So, like, how do you – how do you move on from that in just a week? Like, Sunday coming up and they just play another game. Yeah, okay, let's put it uh, – oh, I, I did cut you off. No, you good. I'm going to go no. back at you done. No. I was going to say, let's put it in a different perspective. Like, yeah. like, like, like Eric, like elevators. You see somebody down the elevator, like, working on the elevator. Are you going to want to really work on the finish of the elevator that day? I mean <laughs> – <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that, that ain't the same it ain't. No, because it's, 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 like that yeah, I mean in context if you make an elevator no, nah he talking about pretty much in front of me down. type no, shit like if a nigga like die in front of me type shit like type shit like nah I'm gonna go home probably not even the next day too that's what I'm kind of referring to like, yeah. like in your field of, you know whatever you do like you see somebody like technically that's the right in front of them yeah that's I'm saying that shit like, so that's what I meant like yeah, who, 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 who's gonna want to resume anything yeah. like? Yeah, but to me, the the turn the fact is, if you gonna go there, what you gonna go home and do? Shit, you gonna shit. go what back you to mean? your you gonna go back to your regular life, but at the <laughs> Not same right then and there, like I mean, I mean, you, ain't you go are, bro, like, like no bullshit. <laughs> nah, <but> like, <laughs> you, you really I are fool. In his situation. What the fuck he gonna do? <laughs> they got paid still though. Yeah, they but, got paid. I mean, that probably so they, get... it's not like they just going home to do nothing. They they, they still got they still get their paycheck. <clears throat> they going home and it's kind of like recoup, recoup. I don't know. Just wait on what the NFL say. Like, well, I, if you if you get suspended yeah. from a job, I put it to you like this. It's hard. It's hard. And I'm more leaning to your side. If that tweet would have waited a day, yeah. it'd have been cool. Because yeah. it's been people who snapped their legs on the field, mm -hmm. uh, broke their necks, mm -hmm. could have been paralyzed, all this stuff on the field, and, and the game resumed. So, if he would have waited to see what, you know, the NFL would have, what, what they would have did, or however, then you put the tweet out, that would have been fine. But the fact that no one knew what the fuck 
was going on. Like no one knew if he was alive or gee, he could have gotten an ambulance and not made it. Like that's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Like so that's how I look at the situation. And when y'all get done wrapping this up, we're gonna keep this on sports and figure out uh, we're gonna talk about something that's oh this situation oddly uh, ironically overshadowed. I don't see how, but go ahead. Next. Uh the fuck. Okay. Well, I'm I'm well back back on um Poetic Skip and Shannon. Oh. People have to understand like if people are so quick, like, you know, they want to skip canceled and all that type of stuff, like this to me, I don't feel like deep down in my heart, and I've been watching Skip since Cold Pizza, nigga. Um Skip is a troll. He's a psychoanalytic person. You know what I'm saying? he's He has his opinions on LeBron or whoever the, the case may be, and he psychoanalyzes everything, and it's annoying. But at at his heart, I do feel like Skip is a good dude. Yeah, same. And he fought, and he fought, and he clawed to get Shannon on that show, and he, he talked about, you know, Shannon in a glowing light, and he really gave him, a black man, an opportunity to really outshine him because it's Skip's show. But it's Shannon's show. Mm. Just like First Take is Stephen A's show. Mm. But it's really Michael Irvin's show now. Like, you know what I'm saying? He gave him that platform. So, and Lil Wayne is his best friend. We're going to get on Lil Wayne a little bit too. Like, so, like, I don't, I think at his core, Skip is a good dude. But his ways, sometimes, like, they come out at the wrong time. And I feel like that's all that was. But hopefully, Shannon, a brother to him, can, um, can hope can like inform him and educate him on how he was wrong and skip hopefully can correct that going forward but um shannon's brother actually was paralyzed in the game so that's that's one of the reasons why he didn't come to work that that following monday but that's all i got because like definitely like he said he been through there like you know what i'm saying he you know that that does probably hit different like somebody who's been a part of that yeah And, and 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 not to discredit anybody else's injury or things that happen on the field like they have to like revive this guy. Yeah, revive him, bro. Like that person could have been gone. So that's why, that's why it looks so bad. Cause that person could have been gone. Like, that and that and memory. that's the key. You, you want us to just move on? Like oh for six days later, you know what I'm saying? Someone just died on the field. Like, yeah, that was definitely the key. That's definitely the key. <clears throat> yeah. 